This is Riverwatch for December 2nd, 2022. In a landmark determination, the U.S. EPA has exercised the agency's authority to begin the process of promulgating new water quality standards for the Delaware Estuary, superseding the authority of the Delaware River Basin Commission. The EPA granted a legal petition filed by environmental groups, including the Delaware Riverkeeper Network. The organizations say the DRBC and the four watershed states have failed to recognize that the Delaware Estuary, from Trenton to the top of the Delaware Bay, is being used for maintenance and breeding of resident fish and other aquatic life. The decision comes two weeks after the Delaware Riverkeeper Network and other groups held a rally and symbolic funeral in Philadelphia calling on the DRBC and other government agencies to take action to protect the federally endangered and genetically unique population of Atlantic sturgeon found in the Delaware. On December 7th, the DRBC is scheduled to vote on regulations for the import of frack wastewater into the Delaware River watershed and the export of water for fracking outside the basin. The commission has already adopted a ban on fracking in the watershed. The Delaware Riverkeeper Network, other environmental groups, and hundreds of thousands of residents living in the watershed are opposed to the import-export rules, saying the measures contain loopholes and will cause pollution and water depletion. The public will not have an opportunity at the commission meeting to comment prior to a vote on the resolution, but a Facebook event has info on how to provide input. Environmental groups, including the Delaware Riverkeeper Network, are criticizing a last-minute decision by the Pennsylvania DEP to withdraw a new safety standard for manganese in water. It's released into the environment during mining operations. Experts say the substance accumulates in the bodies of fish and people and that high levels in drinking water can cause health problems.